In this video, I will show you how to remove a watermark from a video in Canva. So let's jump straight into it. So here we are, as you can see on Canva. Now I've currently got a example video. So you can see if we play this, we've actually got a watermark in the bottom left hand corner, which is just my logo. Now there's a couple of things you can do to actually remove the watermark. The first thing you can do is actually click onto the video. And if you right click and then click onto detach video from background, what you can do is basically just crop this so that it just basically removes the watermark that way. So that's one thing you can do to actually remove a watermark. And the second thing you can do is actually to blur this watermark out. So to do that, if you come up to element in this toolbar on the left hand side, and what you want to do is just go ahead and type blur into the search box at the top. And you can see some different blur shapes here. So we're just going to take this one as an example. And what I'm going to do is just basically put this over the watermark like so and just make this a bit bigger just so that it blurs out the watermark so i'm just gonna make this bigger and then put it here you want to make sure this is positioned to the front of the screen as well so you can see it's positioned to the front as you can see this is going to blur out the watermark now at the time of recording there's not actually a feature on canva where you can actually fully remove the watermark however these are two very good workarounds that you can use in the meantime but hopefully in a future update this feature will be available but for the meantime these are two good methods that do work very well so that is how to go ahead and remove a watermark from a video in canva with that being said i hope this tutorial did help you out today and if this did help you out i would really appreciate it if you was to consider dropping down below the video leaving a like and also subscribing to the channel. With that being said, I just want to take a minute to thank you guys for watching this quick tutorial and I will see you in the next video.